Hey guys, this is Issues with Toddy One Skip, and I am Toddy One Skip. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for allowing me to be part of your day. It's holiday season. Happy holidays to everybody. I guess this video is probably going to piss off a few people. I don't mean for it to. I just want to call out BS. Bullshit. So, A. Aaron put out a video about Hulk Hogan and Sky Daily again. What's up with that? And why is it okay that he calls out Sky Daily for everything and now is including Hulk Hogan in it? But as soon as we call A.A. Ron out on something he's been untruthful about or he's been deceiving us about or he's led us to believe something different, it's not okay. Now, where is Sky Daily talking anywhere about Aaron? Why did he feel the need in the video before to let everybody know this is her third marriage when he won't let anybody know or didn't want anybody to know that his marriage was being, was having uh, problems and there was a separation going on? Why did he feel it okay? Because he hit on this woman, harassed this woman by emails, all because, according to him, she was fucking hot. What do you want me to do? That's what he said. What do you want me to do about it? She's fucking hot. Called her the C word four or five times. First, he say, he tells the cops uh, crazy that he, he, he said he called her crazy. But then he admits, yeah, four or five times. And did that give her boyfriend the right to hit him? So you see in the video that he said it four or five times and then... The guy hit him. But nobody wants to see that who is following Aaron. You know what? It's okay to say the guy raised a lot of money. It's okay to say he's got a big personality. But it's also okay to say he ain't so good about certain things. It's not okay that he calls, he calls other people out, but nobody should call him out. Why is that okay? Why is he mocking... Hulk Hogan's religion. Listen, you could look up online, can you get baptized after you've decided you're a Christian? I was baptized, I was 57 years old, but I've been following Jesus Christ and, and I've been a Christian since I was six or seven years old. But yeah, it took me that many years to be baptized. Why? Because I wanted to find a church that I felt comfortable with. Because I want, I had already, I, my pledging to Jesus Christ was between me and Jesus Christ. Me doing it symbolically was very important to me, and I wanted to do it in a place that I was sure of. And, and, and the place that knew that I was gay, and they accepted me, and I wasn't going to be damned for it. So there are reasons why people do things and people wait. He could have just started another church. There's other churches that will let you be baptized the second time. The church that I go to, you can only be baptized once. So I'm grateful that I waited. That's personal shit. Why is Aaron okay making fun and mocking? Why? Why is he telling us things about Sky Daly's dad? Why? I mean, if the guy is a legitimate pedophile, let's get charges against him. Why can't we get people to talk about him? Just like in the Danny Masterson, why wouldn't it apply? Why wouldn't they get rid of the, um, the Statue of Limitations? They didn't in the Danny Masterson case because he did make a, that one of the women did make a complaint to the police department. Maybe that happened with the other one, if it's true. See, to me, it looks like A. Aaron just got pissed off that a girl rejected him and his ego got hit. So he says, well, let me just take a bowling ball and destroy every pin around her because she hurt my ego. What is she doing that is pissing him off? What if she is a, a quiet Scientologist who is able to maintain a relationship 
between herself and her parents. And what if Aaron's fucking that up for her right now? What if Scientology just said, I mean, Aaron hasn't been in Scientology for about 10 years now. So what if they just said, we don't want to hear about it, you know. Why is Aaron making a big deal about it? I don't understand why some people think that this behavior is okay, but to call Aaron out on his own behavior is not okay. Because this woman, Sky Daly, I would know nothing about her. Hulk Hogan's new wife, I would know nothing about her. Except stuff that Aaron shared. And it seems to me he really only shared it because he got burnt by a woman that didn't want to be with him. Maybe because he thought she thought he was married. I don't know. We did. Why? Because he didn't tell us about his shit. So this is my problem with everybody that follows Aaron and gets on my, uh, in my comments and tells me, why do you pick on him? Why are you after him? Well, I started by praising him. And now I feel responsible to say I made a mistake. And if it wasn't Aaron, I'd be saying it about somebody else if, I, if that's what happened. But he just keeps doing things and people keep writing to me and saying, you know, you're not being fair. You don't know his business. You don't know this. Why do I know Sky's business? Somebody tell me in the comments, please, why it's okay, Aaron, put this woman out there for everybody to see. What the hell did she do to him? Except not like him back. Guys, I got more important videos to put out there. I really do. I'm working on a couple more videos. I'm hoping to get them out before I get off work in the morning, but I don't know what's going to happen when I get into work. And I also have something to do in the morning as soon as I get off of work that's keeping me at work. Guys, please consider what I'm saying. It's not okay to throw anybody under the bus, especially because they didn't do anything. Unless I'm missing something. Like, where is this full-on attack on AA Iran, either from Hulk Hogan and or from Sky Daily? Where is that? That looks stupid. I keep doing that. I got to go. So, uh, guys, have a good day, a good night. And um, thank you again for letting me be part of your day. Please participate in the chat. I got to get ready to head out the door. Have a good one, guys. Thanks. Don't forget, be better today than you were yesterday, but not half as good as you're going to be tomorrow. Thank you so much.